hey, so wait a minute, not to just like sit here and like relitigate the last six weeks. Uh, I watched that Death Stranding trailer mm. while holding a baby. <laughs> okay. And what part didn't you understand? Man, your commitment to appreciating Kojima's vision is really impressive. That whole bit with them hooking the baby up to the machine and st like literally holding, I'm li is that the... holding a baby that is like needs to be soothed. Was that the Del Toro scene? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Watching that bit of that while going through it, it put it, the whole thing in a much more. It was like obviously already a little surreal, but like then having my own little bridge baby here, your, uh, your own BB, my own BB. Yes. Uh, that no, fuck that. Wait, they called you, the babies BBs. You can see BBs. Get the fuck though. out. They're, what does a BT look like? Bridge babies BBs. I don't care. Um, it's dumb. It made that whole thing seem like. Ten times as fucked up when they're just like, oh, it's eventually the babies go bad. I don't know. I'm like, no, what? The fuck you! <laughs> that, get away, get the fuck out of here, you asshole! You can't touch my baby. Was that part weirder to you than Jeff Keighley being in that game? No, that was like inevitable. Like, come on, yeah, I guess don't so. be crazy. Yeah, <laughs> Like, what are you talking about? Did you see all the people, like, going through Kojima's Twitter and pulling any time he was with... Because, like, he said... Anytime he like, was with a person yes, in a white yeah. room. Because he said, like, I have a lot of friends gonna, that are going to be in this game. And so people were, like, instantly dating mine and trying to, like, piece together timelines. Yeah, there and, was like, another actor that I can't it remember. It was the director of uh, Shaun of the Dead, that guy. Um, oh, yeah. uh, Edgar Wright? Yeah, he apparently he was right. in Japan and he was like, thanks for scanning me. Oh, uh, shit. So, okay. get ready for that. I don't know why I thought... I'm not going to tell you who I just. Why did I Google that? I thought I thought I had seen because you want it to be true. I just typed Kojima Steve Buscemi into <laughs> Google because I thought maybe that. Damn. God, he would be such a good Kojima bad guy. Like we said, mm -hmm. it's been a blur. Yeah, that whole thing, man. That whole trailer. Uh, I mean, I'm going to play that game, yeah. but like at some point, it just like that whole thing just came off to me as like one of the most masturbatory things I've ever seen. I'm Hell yeah. Oh, uh, let Kojima masturbate. I mean, yes, no, know. like let, let him, let the man piss. I, you know, I would say and whatever else, let him super, crank it. Let him do it, but I don't want to watch, you know, and he's cut, making me watch it. Yeah. Like a super he's cut of just about any of his games could come off that way. You're right. But I think that, okay. So the, I think the reason that, that I feel this way about death stranding is because it does not have the context that Metal Gear had. Yeah, yeah, totally. uh, You know, because we did that game tapes, we looked at that MGS2 thing, yes. and you think about expectations, and you think about, like, with the Metal Gear Solid franchise, you start to build and subvert expectations. With Death Stranding, the expectations become more about Kojima than about yes. Solid Snake. Well, yeah, there are, certainly like, there I gotta are, prove there myself. Are, yeah, so, so but also, it, there are people out there, like, predicting pretty strongly that this is... Highly autobiographical. Sure. You yes. Know, where the other games are. maybe not have uh, been. Yes. As much. Um, yeah. All art is autobiographical, man. If you think about it. Uh, and and so like that like that's kind of like rubbing me the wrong way a little bit with mm. all this stuff. Yeah. Is that it's like it's even more focused on him than even MGS ever was, uh, and and that something about that doesn't sit well with me in terms of just like, I want to know about the game and play the game and the characters in the game, but instead it's like, here's Kojima out on the stage and people losing their mind and Jeff Keighley's in the game and yeah, and all and it's just like, it was just a bizarre thing. That whole, that, that whole Gamescom thing was interesting to see because it really felt like Gamescom looking at things and going like, E3 was weak this year. We got to get in there. We, yeah. This is our year to get in there. Let's so announce they, a new Comanche. They, yeah, <laughs> they, they, so they contacted me and offered to cover travel to hmm. go out to that event, to that opening night thing. Huh. Um, like that was the, have you been to Gamescom when it, I've never been. been to I've, oh, so you've never been at all. So they're okay. making, they're making a push. Yeah. So like that said to me, like they are trying to make a push to English speaking press yeah. and, and, and pretty good United timing States. after all that they, the, stuff too. Huh? They, right. the body that organizes Gamescom. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Well, the email came from Keeley, but okay. uh, but it was all like government paperwork looking like stuff. It, it was a bizarre German flag to stamped on the basically. Yeah. Yeah. No, what I, is what is the like governing organization behind Gamescom? Does anybody know? Matt, I, I, I should probably know. Is there a European equivalent of the ESA? The USA. Uh, it's, like, it's, it's, wait, characters are welcome. Is it, US, is, it, is it the USK it, or whatever the the USK board? is the ratings board yeah. in Germany. Oh, I thought Peggy was the. Oh, is it Peggy? Is it, oh, it's you, national. German is has Peggy, German has just, a specific just, one. Just the UK. No, Peggy is actually over, but you, German oh, has right, weird right, because they've got very strange. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, so content regulation. You, I think USK actually cooler than Peggy. Well, they had a cool office when I went there. Hmm. Who's Peggy? Peggy's the 
European. It's the lady that tells you which games you can play. Oh, you, you, oh, you, oh wait, you would like because it's like a name. It's like Piggy yeah, eighteen. Is she cooler than Piggy twelve? Yeah, because she can drink. Oh man, yeah. You go to jail hanging out with Peggy twelve. Yes. Uh, all right. You guys know Peggy's short for Margaret. What? What I, the fuck? Get out of here, Camp. All right. right. How does that work? Margaret. I don't know. Margaret. P isn't even in Margaret. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't make up names. Sure you don't, Jan. How <laughs> dare you make fun of me? I'm just gonna take that one at face value and move on. Uh, all right. Two more quick stories, and then you guys can have your. 90 seconds. Well, I got I got to pull a Norman Reedus after the news. Okay. Yeah, me too. All right. Well, we'll get there. We're going to get this mushroom <laughs> real big. Um, 